Hello, I'm frazzled, but I'm here. <laughs> Hi, frazzled. I'm September. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, my mother was just over for a while. Alice entertained her, and... Brain. <laughs> my brain's not all here. Um, and then I didn't know where my phone was, so September helped me find that. And now we're here. We're live, pal. We're live, pal. Live, pal. Oh, now it just repeated back on the stream preview. There we go. Now the volume's down. Here we go. We got Gotham Knights tonight. Gotham yeah. Tonights. Gotham Tonight. <laughs> Yeah. We're gonna. Oh right, I turned my uh, my headphone volume down. That's why you sound so quiet. Ah, that makes sense. Yeah. Hey, bad so, road. Hi, bad road. So Mox came to me with a with an album. Uh huh. Um, because they had recommended this artist to me before, and I and I quite liked that album, but I didn't bother to like investigate them very much. Uh huh. Uh, so while. Uh, your mom was over. Mox was just like, "Hey, you should listen to this album with me." I was like, "Okay," and it's like, "Oh, here's twelve tracks about uh how being different in a place that does not prize difference uh is difficult, mm -hmm. but joyful." Uh huh. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. It's uh you oh, fuck. Let me. I'm not going to talk about it and then not name the album. That's shitty of me to do. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just going to click these buttons. Uh, the album is called Agnes and Hilda by Patricia Taxon, T-A-X-X-O-N. That is pretty cool. There is Steam. What is Steam? What even is Steam? I like that I can immediately spot Gotham Knights because it shows that someone's playing it. That's very helpful just... for me. Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, did you know your wife is playing that Batman game you play all the time together? <laughs> it's just a little, a little green person next to it. Mm. Like, yes. And if you hover over it, it says who. But that little green person helps me spot it. Hi, Beekeeper. Hello. Video game. I hope that the game works this time. That's like, it wasn't last week that it started fucking up, right? It was the week before, and it didn't fuck uh -huh. up last week. I never know what to think is going to happen. I don't have. Wow. Memory. Grayson looks way less threatening than he should. I think it's because I took off all the pirate gear. Right, yeah, it was, yeah. uh, I turned the, uh, anti-aliasing off, because that apparently ca was causing huge trouble on NVIDIA cards. Ah, uh, right, and, and aliasing why... is where the menace lives. Yes. You're gonna have anti-aliasing. You need to make sure that they're also anti-cop. Yes. I don't remember which character I was playing. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Uh, I think I was playing Dick last. Yeah, last week I think it was Grayson and uh, Tim, so it's... Jason. Not to be confused with Grayson. Mm -hmm. Well, the dogs have decided they want to wrestle now. I'll allow it, but be nice. Oh, whoa. Yawn. Okay. Oof. I don't think Gaston wants to play that bad, Rizby. Oh, just never to, mind. He's been drawn into it. Just waiting for you to let me in. To the game. <laughs> Thank you, Bad Rose. Oh, right. I have to. Sorry, the dogs are going wild over here. Yes, I know. They're much closer to me than you. They're like six feet away from me. Oh. It's probably about equidistant. Yeah. All right. Um, I don't want to 
snap at them and get them to stop because they haven't been able to play a lot the last few days. So hopefully they'll tire themselves out in a minute. Alright. Friends, because my wife is also my friend. That's, That's called true. a healthy relationship. It is. Turn that down a little. And I'm getting into the social queue. Okay. Getting into the game invite. Turning on my Christmas lo-fi mix that I forgot to have up. It's fine. Uh, I mean, if this was a Batman Beyond game, that would even be super fitting. Yeah. Hey. I like that sometimes, because of how Barb's run cycle looks, uh, it'll look like she's leaving her name tag behind. How do you mean leaving her name tag behind? Like it looks like she's going faster and it's dragging behind her because she leans forward and it stays over her center of balance. Ah, uh, okay. I see. Oh, also if I turn the camera, it actually does leave the name tag behind, which is even weirder. Oh no! Oh, that's weird. Okay. Did it always? I don't know if it always did that. Maybe it did. Anyway, let's see what case we want to work on. We've got um, the masquerade. We have to check the evidence board. So masquerade is, is that Clayface. No, Clayface is there. Who is, oh, we don't know Probably who's on the, the masquerade yet, right? Yeah, because it's part of the Court of Owls thing. Ah, right. So we're going to go to the masquerade and collect a bunch of audio samples to match them against the right. audio samples we got from the Court of Owls to try and figure out who's who in that organization. Okay, that sounds like the thing we should do next because Mr. Freeze and Clayface... Our, the next mission is above our level, and we've seen how that turns out. Yeah, considerably. So It's like not even as difficult, per se, but it takes forever because we do no damage. <laughs> okay, let's see. So, yeah, let's do the next story mission, which is for levels 10 to 12. All right, check the evidence boards. Let's go. Great big ages six and up energy. Hey, Freya. Do the dogs okay. have cabin fever? No, it's because Gaston's been injured, so he hasn't been able to play. But he's able to put his uh, all of his feet down now. Still trying to get him to take it easy for a bit longer, but he's not into that. All right, priority intel. Um, I'm checking the evidence. Is there a different place on the evidence boards I'm supposed to check? Oh, apparently just looking at the evidence boards was enough to change that. It says, meet Mark Hendricks. Hi, I'm Mark Hendricks of Mark Hendricks and Sons Marks and Hendricks. I'm not good at these. All right, I should be looking at uh, what's craftable for him, too, before we head out. Uh, yeah, I'm just having a look through my AP and stuff. Hmm. We have... Three suit blueprints, um, none of which are more powerful than mine. We got three. Wow, well, those are also not as powerful as mine. And those are only as powerful as mine. All right, so Jason's up to date. I like how he runs like the Incredible Hulk. Brrr. Yeah, I don't have anything that's a significant upgrade from what I have now, so... Well, let's kick some ass, then. All right, let's go wiretap these rich people. Hell yeah. That's a good conversation. <laughs> you want to talk about it? Leaves. The aggressive head down run seems appropriate for the character. Yeah, Jason's got Angie Walk. Mm hmm. Also, he wears a hoodie like Alex from Prototype, which used the Hulk Ultimate Destruction Engine. Oh, I that's... never 
realize that Prototype used the Hulk Ultimate Destruction Engine, but yeah, you're right. It's exactly the, not exactly the same, but it's so similar, like, movement-wise and stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to hop over here because Jason's got the hops. Oh, that's cool. I'm just going to... I'm just going to... I'm just gonna, just gonna, I'm gonna glide. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, I'm not making this. <laughs> oh no! Why did I try to go all the way across the bay on one glide? Right. As far as you have to do the Mario World thing to give it a, to get height. Yeah. And I'm not good at that. I was never good at it in Mario World. It's fine. I'm just going to uh, pull over onto this roof. Jason's can't gain height, which is a little frustrating. But it also doesn't lose height as quickly as Barb's. <laughs> My name is Alex Mercer. I'm nobody. Oh, I thought you were splashing into the water there. Oh, no. I, I was keeping track of what I was doing. Not well, <laughs> but... Oh, hey, look at all these firefighters. Hello, firefighters. I think we're too late. Hmm. Uh, behind us. It says it's this way. Above us? Around us. Among us. Among us. Among us. Added, said, said loudly to increase comment section activity. Oh, hi. Holy shit! I forgot how brutal Jason's takedowns are. Yeah, he's the he's the big boy. Uh huh. Guy shot me from behind, so I started shooting at him over my shoulder. Hey, rude. Ow. I've forgotten the controls. Whoops. Yeah, I've got him now. Whoop! No, I still don't got him. Do you remember how to get these owl ninjas to stop dodging? Uh, grab? Hey. Is that not it? No, I don't think so. I think it's like one of the momentum abilities. Okay, well, I was shot very quickly. Um, you seem busy and there's nothing I need to craft right now, so I'm just going to respawn. Okay. Uh, Beekeeper is not hearing game audio. Oh, I didn't realize audio. you died. How did, is anyone else hearing game audio? Because I can fix it. Ah, uh, once this scene is over. <laughs> no game. Oh, okay. Then something got fucked up during an update again. Oh, I found a battering. Fuck. That's, not, that's not useful right now, but. I like the very traditionally metropolitan way they call this historic Gotham and not disused Gotham. Nah, so heavy attacks work well for the uh the ones with the uh the ones with the shields uh -huh. the the court of owls piercing attacks thank you
get a piercing attack to go off if there's only owls. Okay, oh, we, we lost, apparently. All right, let me see what's up with the game audio. <clears throat> okay. All right, let's see here. Something. Oh, it's muted for some reason. Oh. That's odd. It is odd. I, I wonder why that's the... a thing. Let me check something. No, that's fine. Yeah, I have no idea how that happened. Uh, thank you all for saying something. Really appreciate it. All right, so it should be good now. And now that we're not distracted, um, we can save Mark Hendricks. The world's strongest man. World's strongest Mark, anyway. It took me a second to realize you were saying Mark as every word describing Mark Henry. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's okay. I'll be back into it in a moment. I did have to take uh, medicine for my back, so I may be a little slow on the update. Mm -hmm. And before anyone gets all judgy, it doesn't matter that it's not a pain. People need painkillers for legitimate purposes. And uh, the opioid panic hurts everyone. See how I, I went around that? I did. The Instead of saying panic. like, yeah. All right, so here's, here's the world, here's the assassin of the world's strongest man. I bet that's Hendrix. We need officers near the Gotham Naval Research Facility. They want us to do silent takedowns. Yeah, this time I won't dive in fists flaming is apparently what I'm going with. Fists screaming. One of them ran over towards you. Yeah. So there's one silent takedown. Right. Um, got to figure out how to get close to them. Oh, I see. I'm going to grab this guy. Okay. I don't have the mission. It just says locate Mark Hendricks still. I was getting this guy. Okay, I'll get oh. the other one. Bill just says locate Mark Hendricks. What the fuck? Are we supposed to do something else first? Does, does yours have the proper um, mission stuff? Or silent takedowns? No, it's, mine does still say locate Mark Hendricks, which I think we've done. Yeah. <laughs> Look at these idiots volunteering for a beatdown. I love this piercing attack. I do not know how to do a piercing attack. Uh, RB plus Y. Okay. Needs a bar, of course. Oh, I need to defend them also. Yeah, that's what yeah, I mean by a bar. bar. You just said, yeah. yeah. My brain also isn't top notch at the moment because holidays uh, do that. Yeah. It just. How are we supposed to get momentum going if we can't hit anyone? Right. Oh. Must uh, be another okay. way. Oh shit. You're no quitter. Get up. Yeah, I don't actually know how to hit them currently. This one I can probably grab. Yeah, there we go. And then explode. I can probably grab this guy now. Yep, I'm gonna throw him at the guy you're fighting. I would appreciate it. Boom! Well, that's a hit. Nice. Team up attack. Together. Oh, sure. One, two, three. Uh, they Fuck explode yeah. because they're corpses, I think. No, those ones explode because I strap bombs to them because Jason is very hardcore. Not a subtle man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm literally strapping bombs to them when I throw them using an ability. 
talk to Mark Hendricks. I had a feeling this day was coming. You wouldn't believe the things that I heard at the hotel. Yeah, the court seems to like their privacy. Shit, they're real? That explains the masks. Look, one of my guys was feeding them info. And you know what? You should probably have all the same intel, too. Hope you got a good therapist. And thanks for the drive. This city is going to the birds, I swear. Aha! You get we're it? <laughs> Care of it. Yes. Hendrix handed me a data drive after I saved him. Excellent. Please return to the Belfry so we can evaluate next steps. Any one thing you want to take care of before we head back to the Belfry? I was just gonna ask you that. Let me have a look at the over map. Um we can there's a bunch of people we can talk to. Wanna work for the penguin? I guess. Like his money spends. Down, oh shit, cops! GCP. Oh right. So you, I'm up here. I'm gonna see if I can silent take down one and then run away. I, I'm taking the high ground, like no cop ever has. Um, Better take a look. Someone's here. We got a mask. Get him, cop. Where he go? They don't know where the fuck I am. <laughs> they don't know what the fuck happened. Oh, that's so good. I can take down all of them. Um, let's... Oh my god, this is this is good. All right, this time I'm gonna do a full-on ambush takedown. Uh huh. Need to get over Well. Just, and then I'm just grappling away. I don't see Red Hood anymore. <laughs> oh, this is good shit. Ambush. Brutal. That's just like actually how people die, I think. But having their face stamped into the pavement? Yeah. Yes. It's okay, they're unconscious. Right. I'm just gonna take down all of them real quick. Ooh. That made me do an aerial attack instead. Whoops. Yeah, Bad Road says also they're cops, which is correct. Um, I'd take a little bike, um, over to Penguin Town. Yeah, I'm gonna head in that direction, too. These last two can live to tell the tale. It's just the bike was gonna take a while, and mm. I didn't wanna... And game crashed. You seemed like you were having a good time. Really? Yep. Again? Yep. It's like a smooth crash, too. So this is I, different. I want to like this game so much. Mm-hmm. Okay. Gotham Knights game crash to desktop. Check the integrity. Oh, yeah, I've already done that. Fuck off, you fake website. God, I hate search engines now. Uh, I'm going to get some water for myself. Okay. Real quick, while you're searching this up. It says, My game CTDs all the time in co-op on PC. Haven't played single player yet, don't know if it's co-op related. It's just playing with a friend, was going well, suddenly my game crashed, then whenever I try to rejoin it crashes. Restarting PC fixed it. Uh, I had this issue three days in a row and I had to shut down my PC in between. Oh no. I don't want to cut the stream. I don't want to cut the stream to do this. This is very frustrating. So this is apparently a known issue that just hasn't been fixed in the past couple months. A 
is infuriating. Like my computer was restarted not only a couple days ago too, so. I don't know what to do about this. Very frustrated by this game's technical issues that seem to be worse now than when it was released. No one's got a solution. Some people are saying restart your PC between plays, but mine has been restarted since the last time I played this. Chill, doggies. So I don't know what's going on here. What's wrong, baby? One sec, dog. Someone's outside. Cross the fucking street. Do that. That. Neither. Up. Up. Well, the internet's fixed anyway. I don't know. Maybe we can, like, stream something else. <laughs> uh, this is... Apparently a problem that a lot of people have had since the game came out and they're not doing anything to fix it. And the only solution that they have is to do something that doesn't match up. Uh, so I don't think that'd fix it. Game corporations really do consider fixing bugs to be an unacceptable loss of money. Yes, they do, and it's very gross. <sighs> oh. Let's try it once more, and if it crashes again, we'll figure out something else to do. That sound good? Yeah, that sounds fine. All right. I would like I would like to continue playing Batman because the game is fun, but I am fine hanging out with you. Uh. Like last week, turning off the uh, anti-aliasing actually fixed the crash. But this is something else, because it was crashing during that Clayface fight. Mm. Chase. I feel like, uh, logically, we can't say that turning anti-aliasing off fixed the crash, because realistically, all that happened is we turned it off and then it didn't crash again, but those two things might be unrelated. That seems unlikely because it was crashing at a very specific spot until I turned it off. And then it, there yeah. was no problem. Yeah, okay. And a lot of people have been saying that anti-aliasing is causing crashes, and this has been confirmed, especially in that fight. Uh-huh. Um, mm -hmm. You um, appear to be tooling around Gotham City. It's getting over... Um, away from the, the water. Um, it should call you in where I'm at. Oh, right, because um, you're not in a quest quest, so yeah. it won't do that thing. Yeah, it should be fine, because this is just overworld stuff. Joining host. Interesting is that without the anti-aliasing, or I should say with the aliasing. Um, it almost looks like they're drawn with an outline. Oh, yeah. Which would have been a strong choice for a comic book game. Oh, no, it put you all the way over there, huh? Why wouldn't, it, why wouldn't it put you next to me? so bad. Mm-hmm. I love them. But they're so bad. Mm -hmm. Some of them. They really have gotten worse as a rule just in the past um, 20 years or so in a lot of ways. Most of which um, involve um, uh, capitalism. Yeah. Yeah.
Do do. Unit needed by Big Form Security. No. Electricity surges have been spotted. Use caution in responding. I'm not saving a security company. That's their job. Hmm. Yeah, must not be a great security company. Uh huh. I'm not gonna recommend them to any of my uh, Facebook friends. On Yelp. On Yelp. My Facebook Yelp. Is the Ice Boy Lounge. Oh, he's just outside now. We don't even have to run to his office. Yeah, because remember last time he said, I'll meet you on the roof. Don't come to my office. I can't afford to replace my door again. Right, I didn't remember that. It really went like hard Danny DeVito on his design. I like it a lot. Me too. He looks like a cartoon Danny DeVito, honestly. Welcome back. Had a good time rubbing elbows with the beautiful people. They're not my type. So, what did you want to talk about? Straight to the point. I like that about you. So, how's about a little partnership? Thanks. I always thought about how I'd run this place. To start, I'm gonna need this office for myself. <laughs> you misunderstand me, friend. As the owner that, uh, of the respected establishment, Batman Returns that had face. Danny DeVito? You could yes. help. You mean take out your company? As the Penguin, of course. Uh, I'm not in the crime business anymore. So if I came across any unusual gear... You do want to see Danny DeVito as the Penguin, Freya. There's a place to go. I'm only doing this because I'm already going after those criminals. Well, that's the spirit. Yeah, so the first Batman, Val Kilmer? Uh, Mike, Michael, Michael Keaton. Keaton, yes. Val Kilmer uh, was so, like the last in that series, I think. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. So the first Batman film with Michael Keaton as Batman is quite good. It's got the Joker in it. Where do they get those wonderful toys, etc.? It's a very interesting and unique take on the Joker, too. Y yeah, uh, with Jack Nicholson as the Joker, and Jack Nicholson's sort of a piece of shit, but... <laughs> yeah. Good actor and doing a good job as noted piece of shit, the Joker. Uh, Batman Returns has... Uh, what? Uh, her last name's Pfeiffer. I can't remember her first Shall? name for the fucking life of me. It's Michelle Pfeiffer is Catwoman. And uh, Danny DeVito is the Joker, or, or uh, Danny DeVito is Penguin. Yeah. And, uh, and yeah, they're both very fun to watch. The first one that, is better. Was that Tim Burton doing the scene, like the set design for that? Yeah, and or did it just look like that for no reason? No, he was uh, directing that, which is why he didn't direct the Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, right. Yeah. All right, let's see. Um, we can stop off at Montoya. These characters we talk to each open up new stuff, I guess. Yeah. There's also the Neighborhood Watch, whatever they're called. Yeah, The they're Watch. The because watch. Neighborhood Watch has some very negative connotations. It sure does. Um... Yeah, I guess we can just go around to each of them through the teleports. And then we'll have all the current side activities open. Or we can just head back to the watchtower and turn this one in. No, I think it's a good idea to open up all the things. Okay, I'm going to go over to Old Gotham real quick then. Okay. I'm going to follow you. Hey. So that I can hear the dialogue. What? You fast travel fast. Yes. Okay. I was like, wow, you got over there really fast. <laughs> I forgot we had access to that. Yeah. It's very nice to have. This game went hard on the uh 
Spider-Man game design, but didn't have the budget or manpower to get all the way to it. On the bright side, they're at least mostly showing the cops as terrible, terrible people. Even if it's clear there was some executive interference in that area. Goes through this whole first mission showing you that the cops are your enemies. And then, like, it oh, tries to discourage you from fighting cops. <laughs> Even though they're immediately hostile to you no matter what. Uh-huh. There's definitely some, uh... Different... There was definitely several sets of people um, fighting over this. Hi, Montoya. Wow, she is... She is almost as big as Jason. Huh. She is very large. That hadn't even occurred to me because of how she's built. Mm -hmm. But Jason's like 6'3", and Don't she's like an... Like that. And she's only like an inch shorter. Yeah. Not letting me talk to her. Oh, there we go. I had to turn the camera towards her. I'll wait till you're here. I am quite close. I probably should have just fast traveled also, but I wanted to take the opportunity to use the glide while I still had it before I had to go back to moving slideways next week. Uh huh. Oh, the regulators are over there doing something. Yeah, usually. Okay. She just literally uses her cape like wings. It's really good. I'm surprised you're not out there busting heads, Montoya. I like that make a difference. The department's a joke now. There are more cops on the take than ever. Criminals keep getting now? appealed. Now? That was the whole point. That's why Gordon was the only non-dirty cop. God damn it. We could count on you guys to help. Now you're the enemy. Feels like we're fighting a war on every front. Kane's just pissed because we're not intimidated by her. She can threaten us all she wants. We're not leaving. I don't know if I should be sad or relieved. Probably both. As much as I hate to say it, it's... It's good to have you guys here. Because we'll need more than a few honest cops to save this city. Hey, <laughs> no shit. someone's life out there. Next one is what's his face over in Otisburg, uh, Toshio. You're the number one water cooler topic. I'm gonna go to since there's not a fast travel to Otisburg. I'm gonna drop at Bowery and head west. Okay. actually tagged Toshio so I could immediately start hopping towards him. I guess all in all Dick and Barb are, like, the only ones who have fun fast travel. Jason's and Tim's just kind of suck. Looks fun. I know I keep saying that, and you keep telling me that it's not. It's literally just hold down a button in a direction and you go. There is nothing else to it. Oh, I went past him. He's at the top of this building. But this um, map is really bad at letting me place waypoints on people. Let's follow the compass. Not to be confused with the Krampus or the Chungus. Uh, not one level down here, I think. 
I guess so. Whoa. There he is. Where did you come from? The <laughs> night. We came from the night. He's decided he wants to face you, so you have to stay still so I can talk to him. I'm sorry. <laughs> he just keeps turning away from me. <laughs> Thank hey, you. <laughs> I'm Red Hood. Hi there. Owl, I'm Orange Coat. Or Mr. Mishima to my students. Are you a teacher? Yeah, high school. By day anyway. I work security here some nights too. Plus the watch. Bet you could use a vacation. Bet you could too. I took this job for some extra cash to help out my students, buy school supplies for kids who need them and such. I just want my kids to have a safe place to learn and grow up. I can help with that. Fill me in. Good luck. Oh, I said yeah. fill me in, not turn away and look confused. Yeah, I mean, it's too bad that he doesn't have, like, contact with a ultra-rich billionaire who could probably single-handedly change the fortunes of the entire Gotham City school system with a couple of well-placed donations I'll let you know if I or anything. I guess Lucius has a side quest to give us two now. He wants us uh, to craft state-of-the-art gear. Oh, I think he has stuff for us, actually. Yeah. Goodbye. Uh, yeah, yeah, right now it just says visit Lucius, so that's all I know. Look who's come to visit. Okay. Didn't even have dialogue. He just gave me 2,000 XP. Oh, neat. And a mod. And a mod. Which I have no idea what kind of mod it is because the menu is really bad. Let's see. Fuse mod chips. Sure. All these low level ones. Let's just fuse them all together. Oh, can you do that? Uh, oh. Uh oh. I should have been doing that. Yeah, me too. I have like a hundred mods or some shit. I have, a, I, have a, I have an awful lot of mods that go down to like three. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna take some time tomorrow and just fix all this. Yeah, I probably should too because I have like a billion of the fucking things. Um. Yeah. Uh, now back to the Belfry, I suppose. Uh, yeah. Let me check and see if there's anything that particularly jumps out of me. But yeah, the Mystic Leap tutorial and uh, crime scene investigation. Um, nothing major though. Yeah. Need to like take a look, couple hours just like on my own time and do all the map fucking this game wants me to do. Mm hmm. Azio like... Mishima. Bad Road said, I don't know what it was in reference to. Um. I don't either. Hey, Polygram Talia. I've uploaded the data we got from Hendrix. It should be ready soon. I've seen Bruce make that same face when he got stuck on a case. What's on your mind? Everything starts with Ra's al Ghul attacking Batman. He pronounced it right. I can't figure out how it connects. You've never had to fight the League, have you? Hey, Tim. Hey, hey, Grace. Gracious. Don't be a fucking dick. Through <laughs> the corruption all over the world. His philosophy, if you want to call it that, that he should destroy things to build them back up. He's wiped out multiple cities over the centuries. He set his sights on Gotham. Batman stopped him. He was impressed, so he named Bruce his heir. That suddenly, even though Bruce said no thanks. But it meant Raish left Gotham alone. That is until he showed up and... Bruce.
Talia says Raish was behaving erratically when he died. Yeah. I put money on that not being the whole story. Yeah, well, that's the bug. Hang on. What if I our like that when it's closed hard, it goes pump. Batman died while he was investigating the Court of Owls. You think Raish found out about it? But why come after his heir? That's my favorite thing about hardcovers. Two things. Rooting out corruption and protecting the Lazarus pits. Yep. So if the court was using an extract from the pits to create talents, I spell it P O M F. Steps in himself. Things escalate. Um. Both he and Bruce end up dead. And without Batman keeping a lid on Gotham's corruption, the court starts to stretch its wings. The League follows Rache to Gotham, and there's nobody to stop them from attacking the court. No, the Gotham's court is from Gotham. Zero for a goddamn war. I already Batman know this. Safe. I guess that's our job now. Yeah. It is. And we know what we need to do. We root out the court. And we keep the legal weight from Gotham. I really miss him. Aw, buddy. Oh, buddy, you had three friends there and not one of them was, like, gonna help you? Fuck. Jesus. Excellent. The drive Mr. Hendricks provided Rick us... Rick was gonna say something, something and then didn't. I've set up a... Harbor got house. intense and Jason is... The original one was compromised. 900 feet tall. Glad to hear it. He's... he's just so... He's just so vascular. <laughs> <laughs> so vascular. I think that Jason is just way shorter than he looks because Alfred is also almost as tall. I think Dick, yeah, Dick's taller. Jason just looks tall because of how he's built. He carries himself big. Oh. Oh, he's tall for his height. Dude's last name was Mishima, and a lot of people were amused at how Kazuya Mishima was announced in Smash Bros. by the system voice. <laughs> Let's see, what do we got next? And, uh, What's up? Kitty. Is it Kitty? Is it Bat Kitty. Cat? I don't know if that's a real thing or not, but there's a cat over here. Oh, there was a bat dog, though. Yay, kitty. Just hanging around. Oh, I can't pet the cat. No, a cat is too far away. The voice of the court's modulator is going to be a pain to remove. I'll pull up some of Bruce's old files. See how All right, so now we got to go to the Orchard Hotel. <laughs> We didn't discuss it at all. We just walked in the opposite directions at the exact same time. Uh, it was just oh, like, shit. okay, this bit has run its course. All right. Orchard Hotel. Yes, the Orchard Hotel. That's the hotel where they grow apples. Yes. Yeah, um, Superman had the League of Super Pets. Which is a real thing. <laughs> and they made a CG movie of it recently that was advertised heavily and then I never heard about it again. Oh, yeah. They did, huh? Yeah, I wonder what happened with that. Oh, it probably worked out. You know, how things work out. Totally. It was probably like that. All right, let's see. Orchard Hotel. There's a witness under attack right near us. You want to hit that? Yeah, okay. All right. That's a... That's a person. It's a civilian. Yeah. Units required. Can you by police? Or... Activity reported. Officers advised. Use caution. Oh, you want to hit some of them at the same time? 
Yeah. Right. Not giving me that option. That's weird. Oh shit, they heard something. Yeah, they heard me fall down. Ah. Arm grab strikes. That's X, I think. Yeah. Oh! Again, it's absolutely brutal coming off of Jason. Oh, they've got a drone. Well, so do I. Oh, good. All right, that's two grab strikes. Oh, this is wave bay. Look, more scumbag looking for me. Ow. Grab strike number three. All right, so I did just set their uh, turret here on fire. Oh, good. Yeah. Lock and load. Which I should do more often. I think I have two bars of will. Good call. Bring it on. It's okay. They're just unconscious. I'm shooting them unconscious with my gun. It's okay. You're just shooting them unconscious with your gun. I said that one to unconscious fire. <laughs> I'm yeah. solved. The coast is clear. I'm so glad crime has been solved. Um. Gotta go to the Orchard Hotel, which I don't know where that is. There should be a. Oh, yellow. Right? Yeah, it's a big yellow building. Okay. Oh, are those cops appearing? Yep. That's all right. Um, I'm already out of the way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna at least beat up one of them. Shit! Got a vigilante in my sight. Don't let him escape. That I've already escaped. No way. Wanna like you write a book of how to come back, jokes, nerd? <laughs> Now I have to ride through the uh, crowd of cops real quick. Okay, I'm on my bike. On my bike and on the way. Get on your bike. Get up out of it. Just get on your bike. Go for a ride. You know. Cops, you're on. <laughs> I'm not familiar with Bjorn Strong in the art. Uh, that's from a. Uh, it's from Guard's Yard, the Terry Pratchett book. Ah. Uh, it's the sort of character set up for Constable Carrot, who is a human who has been raised by dwarves. Yeah, Terry he's... sort of retcons that into being like. Yeah, he's the guy who says he's just tall for his height. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but in the first book, it's sort of like, yeah, but he's a human, though, as opposed to how it ended up being. It's like, no, nah, dwarfism is sort of a religion, and he's done the thing, so. Ah. Uh, but in the first book, it's like, you should just send him to the city, uh, you know, and he'll meet some other humans, and he'll stop chasing young dwarf women around. And Bob's your uncle. Uh -huh. and, dw and dwarves are bad with jokes and references, so the carrot stat is just like, surely Bjorn strong in the arm is my uncle. Ah, uh, gotcha. It's like exactly the same thing. Uh -huh. So you're telling me I should send carrot to be a duck among the humans because Bjorn strong in the arm is my uncle. 
Old <laughs> RB to use your abilities. Why, thank you, tip, tip window ticker. I use RB to move to my abilities. Uh huh. Now on I'm the bright side. Here. No free on <laughs> I love that zoom out it does. Hang out. Good. The, the party's already started. Find a good spot to eavesdrop on the ballroom. Good. Where no one can see you. No one can know you're there. Guess I'll save my dance moves for another time. Lots of people in here. Oh right, this is in honor of Bruce. Party's already this is started in memoriam. Good thing I remembered my mask. Stay very low. Oh, they got masks and everything because it's a masquerade ball. Mm -hmm. Avoid detection is our only is our only rule. Uh, so as a reminder, I am immune to cameras. Okay, so you can take care of the cameras when such a time arrives. Right now, it's all security guards, though. Uh, I'm seeing a couple of cameras in the big ballroom. Oh yeah, there so, they are. Yeah, but we're not there at the moment, so. Also, I'm dyslexic, so I didn't see them. It's good to point oh. these things out to me. Yeah, I think that it's not. Uh, I think that. Careful, the, that guy's got really good peripheral. Uh, sort of yellow orange color in here doesn't work. Uh, doesn't serve to make the red of the security cameras pop. Yeah, it doesn't doesn't do me any favors, I'll say that. I don't care what happened to you. You promised me a heart. I have to attend this banquet when I'm done. Hey, I'm trying to avoid detection. Careful, tons of guards over there and a very obvious uh camera. You yeah, hack in can you hack it and destroy it, or do we need to find its control panel? Uh, I can't hack it and destroy it, but I am not seen by it. Okay. So I can just sort of walk through. Don't mind me. Might not be a good idea, because these guys seem to have good peripheral vision, too. But they're all pointed directly away from us. They still almost saw me, though. Okay. Like, it started counting up the meter. Yeah, even, re even there it yeah. is. They are very sharp. Look at this fucking dev. <laughs> oh god. That's probably right. Oh shit. Yeah, these are definitely the devs, huh? I don't know. I just look at this picture and I'm like, yeah, I'm sure. I'm gonna get this guy real quick. Good. Now you can shut off the uh, cameras. Disable the security camera. So far, we've avoided detection. The security systems. Oh shit. We better get out of here. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, defeat the security guards. It's changed. It has changed tack. Alright, um... We no longer have to avoid detection, I guess. But we could still try. Yeah. They're coming from the right side. I'm trying to see where they're going to. Doesn't look like they're ready to check in here yet. I could just leave in for vision on. Well, we can at least take two of them down by uh, take out, take down. I think so. Keep looking. Someone's here. Oh, they turned around. No, no, no. I like having the damage numbers on because the takedown numbers are ludicrous. Jesus. I'm talking like 4,000 damage versus the 100 damage I do with an attack. Apparently, it wants us to go up here now. I'm entering the ballroom. Let's get in there. 
I guess we had to... Uh, the camera specifically so gamers could look up. Time to see how many of these weird <laughs> snobs yeah. are court members. Let's get as much footage as we can. Oh, oh, oh? Are you also seeing through the camera? Yes, I am. Okay. Are you able to move yours, or are we, or is it just me? Uh, I'm able to move mine. Have you been to the Hotel okay. Z staircase? The one they sealed off? There, it's on it. We can just each grab as many voice clips as possible. Did you see some of the names in there? I did. Senators, judges, CEOs. I just found uh, Kane and Montoya talking on a balcony. Oh, nice. Kane's like, I thought I told you that this was a formal wear event. Montoya wearing the suit she usually wears and a tie. This is formal wear. Big gay energy. This jazz ought to be a celebration. What do you think this is? Got did find much. Grandma Owl over here. These assholes for much longer. What do you mean you won't see me? There's the mayor. I'm afraid his schedule won't permit it. You tell Colonel Kane that I won't be frozen out. My office demands respect. Of course it does, Mayor Sai. I'll relay your message. <laughs> Hard to believe Bruce Wayne is gone. I know. I was hoping to be escaped this year. Everyone wants to fuck Bruce. All they could muster for the great Bruce Wayne? I mean... It's embarrassing. When I go, it'll be a spectacle. I don't, but I do get it. Uh-huh. He's very charming. He's he's charming and he dresses well. It's like Did a whole thing. Did you hear thing. about Lex's assistant? He deserved to be let go, just like Kirk. People forget their place. All right. Well, those are definitely court members. Yeah, the voice mm -hmm. remembers. I thought I told you that formal wear was required. Ah, found the mayor and uh, Montoya. Or not the mayor, the commissioner and Montoya. Yeah. Not seeing any more clues. Oh, wait, there's one. Business is good. Great evening. Who would have thought this would give the rest of us such a kick in the pants? Sorry to interrupt, but it's time. It's time, says the Herald. We'll have to continue this later. That's another. That has to be everyone. Yeah, there we go. Mm -hmm. It's not super sly to just be wearing your owl mask round. Right? Hello. Surely they must have thought this was a bad idea. Also, unfortunately, some of these um, masks, the owl masks, do bring some anti-Semitic designs to mind. Seriously? So that's not great. Not trying to hide it. Thank you all. This one doesn't. This one's good. You can do an owl design without anti-Semitic symbolism. We are here to remember one of Gotham's greatest sons, Bruce Wayne. No. You all knew the Playboy. Oh, they definitely are going for Diabolic, but you know where that type of design comes the from. Flash defender of Gotham's best. And literal anti-Semitism. Bruce's contributions to this city will be felt for decades to come. This is for you, Bruce. The last of our precious Wayne family. You've helped us in ways you never realized. And may we, the surviving family... Camera just zooms real hard in on his face. ...your inimitable legacy. The gold on the upper and lower lip are all... Also make a bird 
go away. Yeah, it's really, it's some clever design in that one. Shit, that's really him. It's a match for the voice of the court. Oh no, it, it can be traced back, Bad Road. Yeah. This is not something we need to be arguing about. The the man didn't drink to his own toast. Uh, it's probably all poison. I can't imagine he would poison that many people. In undetected for a bonus. We have to locate the voice because we don't know who that is yet. The labs are requesting more Dionysium to meet their production deadline. I'm aware. Arrangements are being made. Let them know that I expect the quota to be met. No excuses. Thank you, sir. Hey, no worries. It's good to learn. Yeah. I've uh, spent the last decade of my life learning. Uh, shit I probably should have known by now. Um, All right, we've got cameras, so you're going to have to take the lead on this one. Yeah. They not all seem like they're in the there. office on the right yeah this is gonna be a tough one to walk down the hall there's not a ton of cover not nah, but i'm gonna rumble up because i think i can oh we can get in through the side hatch over here yeah ah oh, fuck 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 there's actually a room open to the left and right directly in front of me the space that i was trying to get into had an invisible wall so that's why i ran back Yeah, that's where I think the camera controls are. There are... There is one guard in there currently. Uh, Shit. Yeah. I think he can see me. Yes, he can. Okay. <laughs> he kept moving and now he can't. Not going to be able to get away with takedown on him, I don't think. Oh, wait. Yes, I am. Oh, uh, well... well. They just turned around at the very last second. That's some shit. Yeah. That is some shit. Okay. See, the nice thing about the stealth in Arkham is that, whoops, is that uh, there's always predictable patterns as to what they do. But here they seem to wait like random amounts of time when they're standing still. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I'm here, so I'm going to disable the camera. Okay. Uh, there's a treasure chest over here. Excellent. Instruction note. We can't continue the Reno until we figure out where those electrical wires go. I asked a crew to go to the stairwell to see if they can figure it out. But no one wants to go. They keep saying it's haunted. What a bunch of scaredy cats. <laughs> scaredy cats. Chance. What is this? What is this? God damn it, I forgot the name of uh, Full House. The... Oh, what? okay. What is this? Full House? What, what a bunch. 1915? <laughs> what is this? That awful movie that I'm gonna end up having to fucking watch tomorrow? Probably not, actually. What movie is that? Uh, my brain is trying to say One Crazy Summer, and that's absolutely wrong. It's the movie with that kid. And he, it's like a tone piece more than anything, and it's a bread rider, BB gun. Oh, a Christmas something. A Christmas story, yeah. Yeah, that movie sucks. And I think it's, it's very funny. The reason people think of it as a classic is just because it was so cheap. Um, same with that Jimmy Buffett movie. Um, what's it called? Oh, Merry Christmas, movie house! Uh, Jimmy Stewart. Jimmy Stewart. Hey. Miracle on 34th Street? That's not it. <laughs> no, Miracle on 34th Street is actually good. Or at least I thought it was the last time I saw it, which admittedly is when I was like nine. Hey, motherfucker, why can't I get at this movie? Mr. Smith goes to Washington. Uh, is that another example of a cheap movie? No, it's just another Jimmy Stewart movie. I'm trying oh, to okay. The actual one. Yeah, I'm not having much luck with names today either. 
But yeah, those movies, both of those movies were really, really cheap to license because they flopped really hard. So they just play, stations would just buy them to play them over and over again near Christmas. So people assumed that they were good because they appeared to be popular. And I think that's very funny. The Wonderful Life. Yes, that's the one. Thank you. Or in your case, a wonderful wife. Ha ha. You're a wonderful wife. I I know it. <laughs> we both are. Don't that's the secret. The Why didn't we jump out and attack him at any point? Than drunk because we have to follow him to the voice. I lost the signal while he was between floors. Oh, okay. We don't know who the voice is yet. The hidden 13th floor in the hotel yeah, the 13th floor thing. The voice went. Yeah, that's another conspiracy theory, is that the 13 floors are actually used for Illuminati shit. Mm -hmm. But really, people just don't mark 13 floors in a lot of parts of the U.S. I think it's... there's one in... It, there's different numbers in different countries that get left out, but America's yeah. is 13. Because, um... jobs that have a passively really high risk of death like uh, a high rise construction floor, worker rich mm -hmm. weirdo VIP room. tend to have a lot of uh, superstitions superstition. that surround them yeah Belfry. I think that's energy that would be better spent um, on actual safety precautions but what do I know <laughs> Yeah, but this was like the twenties. Yeah, it still happens Everything was today. Made out is steel and asbestos. That's very true. <laughs> it still happens now. Is the trouble? Uh, in Japan, it's the fourth floor because the number. Because uh, it's a homophone. It's a homophone for, for yeah. death. That's yeah. really. In I knew it was the fourth floor in Japan, but I did not know the reason. That's really interesting. That's cheap. Not a clue. Bad road probably knows. Yeah. Found some gramophones. That's kind of like a homophone. Former court voice of the court. So now the voice wants to play hide and seek. Great. Couldn't have gotten far. We're just supposed to. Got any tips to find the voice? Kind of Belfry, you there? I like birds. Damn it! Cut off. That's a good bird. Yeah. It's yellow when I scan it. Yeah. Owl statue. Contains switch mechanism. Oop, look at that. Yeah. yeah, long straight hallway with no cover. Perfect place to go down when you're searching for someone called the voice of the court. Adderon says, yes, she. She. Why can those guys see me? All right, we're going to have to rush out and do takedowns on... I'm, I'm totally right next to you, and you shouldn't worry about it. <laughs> Careful. All right, uh, run yep. in and take down. You take the guy on the left, I'll take the guy in front. Uh, When you say the guy on the left, do you mean the one that's on the left of the big billiard table? Or... Yes. Okay. And I'll take the guy close to us. Okay. Ready? Uh-huh. Three... Two, one. Uh, what was that? There! It's ready! A little a little overkill, I know. See what they were looking at. But now he's unconscious. <laughs> totally unconscious. What's this thing? Architectural plans. These are the original engineering plans for the Powers Club in the Orchid Hotel, as opposed to the plans submitted to the city. These ones include critical differences, such as the hotel's hidden 13th floor, and the secret chambers beneath the Powers Club. So, here's something that I'm having trouble with currently. It's one thing to say that you have a hidden 13th floor, and people just sort of skip over it mentally because, like... 
they're used to not seeing the number 13 on uh, elevator buttons or whatever. Yeah. You can count the number of floors, yep. though, like from the outside. Yep. That's why this one never holds a lot of water. Oh, there we are. What's this? It's a projector, and it goes to this panel. Care to do the honors? Uh, I am not allowed to. Oh, that's surprising. You please do that. I can scan the touch screen, but it doesn't actually finish scanning it, so that's kind of weird. There we go. Ah, screen and all. My name is the voice of the court, and I have come to you with a question. <laughs> We eliminated him. Our allies. Shit. So the court really did off Langstrom. This recording could be just what we need to bring them down for good. But there's still plenty to clean. Destroy everything. Insert. Never existed. We must send a message. That's a lot of names. Hold on. All these people are either missing or dead. Kirk Langstrom is on here. Is this a hit list? Why did we wait to use their computer that we weren't even sure was going to be here to look at the drive? That seems like eh. like that would like leave an electronic trail for them to follow us to. Probably. Because you know uh, someone's coming. That's nice. Oh, well, I didn't get out of the way in time, but I did manage to get a takedown. Nice. Leg. That's a big, big old kick. That's a history of Gotham's architecture. Was the court involved in construction, too? That's the court. Right, there's four pads. Uh, we're going to need to look at our map, probably. City Hall. Do with them. I can... The oh, below. okay. Gotham we're supposed City. to step on them in the right order, maybe? Maybe. Oh. Unique symbol engraved on a plaque, and that's all it says. There must be clues around here. Uh, under the pictures of the buildings, maybe? The numbers oh, that makes sense. Years those buildings were built or renovated by the court. Okay. So we've got numbers. years. Uh, how do we connect the numbers to the symbols? Maybe it's youngest to oldest, so... Starting where? There's not a start to the loop. Oh, I right, see what you're I'm saying. Saying, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're looking 42, at... This is 41. 1836 is the one with a clock and steeple. That's where we start, is 1836. 1836, okay, so that's... So this one to start. Okay, and then... Ah, that filled in. Uh, the one with the giants. This one over here. Yeah, yeah, that one. And then the one with the dome. This one. And then the fourth one. Is this Arkham Asylum? Look at that. Courts, police, politics, and religion. Yeah. The four that genders. All the power bases. <laughs> I should have known it was you. Shut up, voice. Uh, I'm Bond Voice. I almost gave away the ending. I stopped myself. I'm glad for that. Portrait of previous court owls member. Clothing and style suggest this painting takes dates back to the 18th century. True to the court's goals to remain anonymous, this court member cannot be identified. There's a gramophone and a treasure chest in here. Excellent, thank you.
There's also a thingy. A mask. The materials and the slight layer of dust on this mask suggest it was last used more than 30 years ago. As opposed to the court masks used today, this one lacks the protective layer, which prevents it from cracking and breaking. But the former voice of the court's mask already had cracks in it. Maybe he's uh, very, very, very old. Are you going to show yourself or what? Go to the painting. They're just like... That looks like... Uh, well, you made it here. All by yourself. That putty you used to uh, to, to connect drywall. Uh, spackle. Yes. Looks like they just smeared spackle on the paintings. Trying to save her. Preserve her glory. So. I understand now the potential you could have to do the same. Oh. Power and glory. Never had that offer from a weirdo in a mask. The only one hiding there in a mask. Oh, okay. Straight up, I did not know what the fuck that dude was. I know. Yeah, we haven't seen him in person since the very beginning. Maybe if we were playing it all through, we would have remembered what he looked like. Call it loyalty to Martha. If Batman was here, he'd say, Why did you say that name? Trying to shelter the city from chaos. That's a Zack Schneider joke Just about Zack Schneider. Quiet about it. The people of Gotham will find out you've been playing with their lives. They're not your toys. Yeah, Batman would probably say the same thing in your position. That's why I never told Bruce about the court. Looks like such a smarmy asshole. I continue to be fascinated by the acting performances. The same it's enemies. Like what they got out of these face rigs. It's madness. You're not serving us. I stopped killing people. <laughs> a difference in tactics, I'll admit. You say you protect Gotham, but you're racking up a body count. Kirk Langstrom, his assistant. Those who betray us will suffer for it. Langstrom betrayed the court. You betrayed the law. Everything to save this city. You fight for yourselves. You would never have supported this. Do not use my nephew against me. I mourn Bruce. I want answers for his death, just like you. I am nothing like you, Jacob. Understood. I protected Bruce, but I won't protect you. If you won't join us, I'm afraid you'll have to join Langston. Security breach. We're under attack in the ballroom. They came out of nowhere. Question, does he know who Red Hood is? Because he knew that Red Hood cared about Batman. Like, right off the top. Clearly, I have bigger problems right now. Is it? Is it a known thing that they're like... Just stay out of my way. That these are Batman oh like God, yes. Successors. Yes, okay. but this guy shouldn't know that Batman and Bruce Wayne are the same person. Hey, Andy. Right. Hi, Andy. Good to see you. Oh shit, fight coming on. Get back to the ballroom. I'm gonna hide down here. Eight guys. Let's go. Oh, they've awesome. seen us now. Oh. Oh. Hey, I'm hiding. Sweet. You can probably get in a takedown then. I can. Sweet. In fact, if you could just keep them pointing at you on the other side of the hall, I can take them all down one by one. Sweet. Go for it. Nice. <laughs> Got that one with my piercing attack. Excellent. Jason's piercing attack seems to be the best one in the game. I mean, it's a gun. <laughs> That's true. You got me there. The round table from Elden Ring. Oh, God. 
It is very similar, you're right. Barbara. Barb. Having trouble with the doorway? Yeah. Are we gonna meet a dung eater? A loathsome dung eater. <laughs> that was a good flourish you did. Yep. Well. Alright. Now we've got league members. That seems not ideal. No. Yeah, you'll notice how easily they're taking out the fuck. How easily they're taking out the uh the uh court members. Uh-huh. So much so that we don't really get a look at it. No, but I did manage to shoot the, the assassin a couple times there. That was cool. I'm sorry, what? Hey, is that... What? Is that, like, a dialect text? Or is that just fucking Mr. Saturn font? I didn't even notice. When the uh, the uh, league members made uh, pain noises, there was uh, it was text on screen. Oh, I'll have to see check next time we find some. God damn it! These people don't stand a chance against the league. Oh yeah, they're a bunch of old fucking politicians. Hey, bud. Cool dogs, jerks. League is supposed to be Middle Eastern. They're going with a lot of uh, Chinese and Japanese imagery here. So that's kind of weird. Do you see right there? No, I don't think it's showing up on my screen. Oh, there it goes. I have no idea what font that is. I hope it's not something completely made up, honestly. Because that yeah, feels that's not good. Yeah, that's kind of the thing. It's... What show were we watching where someone was speaking in a foreign language and the subtitles that we had said, like, speak in foreign language? I think that was The Devil is a Part-Timer. So, because the other thing about it was the, like, they had another thing where the person was speaking Klingon, and it says speaks in Klingon, oh. specifically. I remember this happening, but I could not tell you. It's not letting me grab this guy. I guess he's ungrabbable. Oh, wait. But you couldn't tell me where he came from. Yeah. That's fair. Oh, nice. It even had the poses correct when the scene started. The GCPD is about to enter the hotel. I'd suggest a quick exit. Grapple away. I'm still in a dream. Montoya, it's Red Hood. I take it you heard what happened at the hotel. I was there, trying to help. Yeah? Then care to tell me who the hell those assassins were? The League of Shadows, that's who. I'll send you what we have on them. I guess back to the Belfry. All right. Press conference. Such a terrible loss of life, and totally Batman's fault. Our best and brightest at the Orchard Hotel is a new low for the city of Gotham. It is time for the real here. Remember, Catherine Kane and Kathy Kane are actually two different characters. And Comics are weird. In our city. To take it back. 
Yeesh. Surprisingly, <laughs> the voices we collected. Hey! Aww. Low blow. The commissioner sure. could still be helping them. She did marry Jacob. Catherine is probably not aware. Nick and Tim really do just act like brothers, and I like that. I know Jacob well, and have never had even the slightest suspicion. Colonel Asshole fooled everyone. Both of which are different than Candy Cane. You know what? You're right. The I like Barb's half-tucked shirt here. Yeah. John Wycliffe? I'm told it's called a Isabel French Haas? Maria Powers. All killed at the hotel. I don't know why. Colonel Kane's the only man. Imagine for the life. same reason as French fries. Probably old lady Just on. someone wanted to make them sound cool. And the court is clearly much bigger than Jacob Kane and Constantine. They chose French to make it sound cool. The almighty voice was right, you know. No one will believe a nursery rhyme's been pulling Gotham's strings for so long. But people will believe that Jacob Kane conspired to murder Langstrom. Yeah, it's a French tuck. I'm not just lazy. David Walker. Let's get this to Detective Montoya. See if it's enough for her to. I didn't understand the reference, but I appreciate it nonetheless. List of known members, dead or otherwise. We need to be careful about this. Jacob will be waiting for us to try something. Someone should talk to Talia. The court and the league are clearly out to kill each other. And let's be ready when we're caught in between them. Ooh, ooh, bad apples in every orchard. The evidence you know, you're mis you're misusing the phrase "bad apples" there again. Game, cut the that out. Isn't doing this city any favors. Uh, ah. court in the league without the cops. All right, so we're gonna take a break real quick. They're about to get a lot more complicated. Uh, here's my stream deck. Remember that there is a civil rights movement happening around the country in the wider world. Black Americans, people of color, are fighting for things that should never have to be fought for. Things like equal rights, equal treatment under the law, to not be attacked, terrorized, and even murdered by the police. We have listed here a few ways you can help, however, and they include the Bail Fund Network to help keep protesters out of jail, the Okra Project and the Black Trans Travel Fund to help black the GCP trans and non-binary people the with Hotel. food, supplies, and travel out of dangerous situations. And the Black Hills Legal Fund, the Lakota People's Fund to take yeah, well, back their land to the six grandfathers that was stolen by white people, from the arbitrarily renamed to Mount Rushmore, and then had some white slave owners' faces carved into the side of it. By the second command, kept up to date by my lovely wife, September here, are more ways that you can help. These are all current campaigns and things that you can do right now, so please let it know if you know anything else that should go here. Uh, it is the eternal September in chat. Black lives matter, the lives of people of color matter, indigenous lives and lands matter, Asian and Pacific Islander lives matter. These are things that we have to keep saying and pushing and fighting for until the people all the way to the top not only understand and acknowledge them, but work to make them real protected truths. We're going to be back in just a few minutes. I'm going to go to the BRB. I'm going to run an ad break. And uh, we'll be back in just uh, three to five minutes or so. Uh, the so we'll see you back here soon. We have no stance on ad blockers. Talia warned us this would happen. But I'm taking these guys down. Thanks, Babs. I'm back. September's going to be a sec. Nerds so, to the rescue. Right, but, so you'll notice that the last couple weeks, uh, I took a bit of a cue from... Uh, from Alice, the way she's been naming the Overwatch streams with the uh, lyrics to Comfort Eagle. And I decided I'd do that in a way that's not quite as meaningful, but I decided to use lyrics from uh, Behind Blue Eyes uh, because no one knows what it's like to be the Batman. But I, ser I searched, into, I put into Google to find those uh, lyrics. I had uh, Behind, Behind Blue Eyes lyrics. And the page that came up Official Google there um, says "Behind Blue Eyes" by Limp Biscuit. So yeah, that's that's where we're at right now. It is a cover, but 
Gotham's trusted voice for what matters to They didn't change any lyrics or anything. It's not a more popular version. They just decided that it was by Limp Biscuit, and I think that's a very funny. Mm -hmm. There it is. All right. Oh, I, d I don't know what happened. Hmm? But I went I went to go, like, refill our water jug while I was uh, up and doing stuff on the break. And Brain decided that it was a great time to launch into a song uh, by Tim Wilson called Acid Country. And just like that, Harley's back at Blackgate. If she calls again with it's more a, research, it's not a good go song. And I don't know why it's still in my head after having not listened to Tim Wilson for certainly over a decade. Uh -huh. Oh, we've got some memories to do. Oh, hey. I have one over here by the bat box. And I have to switch characters around to do this, I think. Hey, you should be wearing your pro. These loads are pretty right? hot. Are you sure the velocity isn't too high? It'll be fine. Besides, it's not like I'll be shooting anyone who doesn't deserve it. You're at the upper safety limit. That doesn't leave you a lot of margin for error. You've seen the body armor criminals wear. <laughs> can't afford to play nice Fuck off. Arms race. Yeah, you know, criminals, well known for wearing body armor. I mean... Uh -huh. If you believe these rounds are safe, then prove it. Shoot me. Shoot me. Proves a point. Got to hand it to him. Fine. Do it. They are a little hot. <laughs> Come on, Bitch. motherfucker. Do it. Tell me what the best <laughs> I like him. I want him to survive. I think he'll be fine. Just, uh -huh. It would just be really funny. Volume and composition. <laughs> if there was a blooper reel for this, that would absolutely happen. But if we tweak the gel compound, we can make up for it. Remember the blooper reel from Snake Eater? That was the best part of the game. I like Snake Eater a lot as a design. I do too, in its own way. I've just, as I've gotten older, I've realized it's not very good gameplay or story-wise. It was really great when I was in my 20s. It's one of those. And I respect that. I'll and I think that, uh, you know, it's it's got things to like about it, and it's one that Kojima didn't have a lot of control over, which made it much better. Mm -hmm. But I the blooper reel is, but the blooper reel is fucking funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, there's one part where uh, Snake shapes his C3 into a butterfly, and there's story reasons for that. And he tosses it into the air, and then he slams it down where it's supposed to go. And in the blooper reel, he does all that, and then he slams it down, and then the detonator blinks and beeps, and then the camera just zooms in on his face as he goes, Ooh. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to the day we'll see. And it was such a good implied explosion. That might be sooner than you think. All right, so I'm going to switch each character into a memory real quick. Some people even want her to start her own talk show. Gotham never ceases. I think my to favorite me. of those is the one where it's the original scene is from the very beginning of the game. Hi, me. Hi, where... Barb. I'm Barb. <laughs> hey, great ass, Barb. You've really put in a lot of work. You too, Barb. It's... I just noticed that she's now wearing skinny jeans instead of the Batgirl tights. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Your favorite one. Oh, oh uh, the scenes from the very beginning of the game where uh, it's, it's the done. intro base. The Wayne Foundation where... has just made a sizable donation to Like Gotham Snake Devils. gets absolutely fucked up and left Thanks, her dead at the side of a river. As many donations and he sees as possible like, the helicopter the going over and because it's a Kojima game, he knows Perhaps exactly I who's on the helicopter. Yep. You to invite others to and in the... the Good idea. The Set it up. Original scene, he like does something. It's like a salute or like a handgun motion thing. Yeah. Uh, but in the blooper reel, they the blooper reel they like 
blur out him flipping off the helicopter. Yes! And the boss is on that helicopter, and she goes, oh, that's a dirty trick, and blows him up with a rocket launcher. Yes! <laughs> that one, I believe, also zoomed on an, in on his face as he goes, <gasps> Yeah. There's, like, there's actually two distinct sets of bloopers, and the other one is just Raiden exists in the background of every scene. And from Harley Quinn. And that's where Raiden, your creative time paradox, comes from. And Harley prayed about right. exactly that. Barbara memory. Hey, look, she's back in her tights. Does the statue of my dad look like him? No. Oh. Somebody else around here who's angry. Bruce is dead. The Court of Owls is real. The League of Shadows is running around Gotham. And you're all trying to pretend everything's normal. This isn't just about the League. Or the Court. I can't remember Dad's face. Every time I think of him, he just looks like that stupid statue. And? And I have a photographic memory. Where I used to. How can I be Batgirl? Solve crime? Fight bad guys? If I can't trust my own brain. Stay angry. And you aim that anger square at every wrong in the world. At least that's what I do. But then... Thanks, Jason. No problem. Hey, killed by Joker Club? <laughs> Guess he wanted it to trick a robot into thinking it was a clay pigeon. Yeah. You probably shouldn't like kill the Semtex, right? Kill whomst? You probably shouldn't put Semtex in a kiln. I don't. What Semtex? Plastic explosive. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably not. Did she ask about me? That seems bad to do. She left a very, very colorful message. Profanity is her hey, memory for Tim. Yes, right upstairs. Apparently, Harley got a hold of her cell number. Oh, no. Is she getting a chip? Already done. She still blames you. I'd call to apologize, but I guess she's probably not much of a phone person. This is it. Alfred's playing right into Robin's trap. Ah, the classic scene of the one move he didn't think of. Wait, how, how'd you... An old way. It's how Alfred wins. Teach me. Robin must discover his own way to win. What Alfred is saying is that he just cheated. Robin thinks that sounds <laughs> way harder. Oh, this is all stuffy. Like, Jason really is the hammer that sees the whole world as a nail. But he's trying, and that's nice. The bar is low. <laughs> the bar's... I like that he's not just a one-dimensional asshole. Help? Mm -hmm. I like that most of these characters aren't no uh, one-dimensional. Like. Mm -hmm. Even Dick has personality here. Yeah, yeah and I don't sure. like him, but he's got it. <laughs> All right. Um, I don't 
don't think... Yeah, Dick doesn't have a new memory here. It might be outside? Maybe, but then it would probably show on the door next to Talia's icon. Yeah, probably. Let's see, I'm gonna zoom out. Yeah. Yeah, blue right there. Where? Uh, right in the middle oh, of the yeah, map you're right. to the belfry. It's weird. I thought last time it showed it on the door. Only do when I'm, wanted... uh... Do what? Do we, uh, we want to just, like, maybe save pharmacy? that for next week? Yeah, we can do that one next week. Anyway. That makes That's sense. Apparently. Well, that adds up. Rather That's than, like, though. going out, doing the thing. Don't worry. They got it all. Coming back. Yeah. And the freaks left it all in one place with a pay-what-you-can sign. Yeah, for some reason, anarchists uh, gave out free food. Yes. Who, who would have thought? Uh-huh. Ian's no leader, but it's uh, it's construed as terror and chaos. What a wonderful phrase. What God's name are we doing? We're talking to Talia. Yeah. She's very close by, too. Oh. You overshoot? Uh, I didn't shoot at all. I was trying to get height and then realized I didn't have to, and now it doesn't matter. I landed right in the circle. I had no choice. Oh, she's being attacked by, uh... Uh-huh. I guess they are mad at her for killing their dad. Uh-huh. Her dad. Their dad. You could have told us your league was planning a murder <laughs> spree at the charity ball. Does this look like my league? Did they decapitate the court? Did you? No. Despite all the killings, the voice is still alive. Then the League will keep attacking, regardless of collateral damage. And the court will send their talons to retaliate. How many of Gotham's citizens will die in the crossfire, Talia? Who have failed the city? The League will decimate the city. And the court is preparing something even more impressive. And that is? Langstrom wrote that living subjects could create more powerful talents. I don't want to be around when they get out. What else do you know about what Langstrom was doing? As much as I've liked our chats, Gotham is getting to see He answer. was turning into a bat. I'm looking for me. What else would also, you Also, I am here. Did you get all that? Also, you are here. Yeah, we got even bigger and badder talents coming for us. We I like that from the back, your mask just looks like a hat. Let's find some more helpful oh, sources. Oh, I mean, it is. It doesn't... It stays, like, above the ears. Yeah. It goes over it, the eyes, though. It looks like I painted a KFC bucket and drilled some eye holes in it a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, eat popcorn out of that. Yeah. And, yeah, the ears would probably dig into your thighs while you're holding the popcorn, but, yeah. Or you could use them for balance. Or you could use them for balance. And not the thing I said. <laughs> I guess it depends on how wide your thighs are. For instance, mine, they would probably dig into. My thighs are wider than my head. Ladies. Ladies. So are we going to go try and find Talia, despite the fact that she just said, don't try and find me? Oh, almost certainly. Trying to figure out what I'm looking at here. Case files. Little birds. Oh, Talk to Montoya. Montoya. Yeah, that's what I thought. Such a small cameo. <laughs> Maybe we can get her on cameo. No. Re known real person, Detective Montoya. Known real, known real person, Detective Renee Montoya. On cameo. Yep. That's what uh, she's most known for, you know. Is yeah. uh, being a real person who's real. A known real person. Yep. Jeez, I should have just fast traveled. I'm afraid the game's going to crash any second. <laughs> Huh. 
City Hall. Far off. Ah, yeah, she's close enough now that it would actually take... I think that, yeah, the fast travel would actually put me further away now. Big oh. flaps. Big flaps. Have I ever told you that story? The big flap story? Nope. So this was a D&D campaign that uh, okay. a friend of mine was running for a bunch of our other friends. Uh, not the famously overstacked one. This was a, this was a different one. Mm -hmm. And we had gotten to quite near the end of the campaign. We were like trying to Thanks sneak for up an on eye the us. army. And the way that we had decided to do that was to just sort of fly in with uh, our with our mage kind of taking the lead. And it was like, okay, well you're flying, so you're not making like because of ground you, troop another noise. honest cop. So go ahead and like add a shift. plus five to your stealth roll. And our mage rolled a one. Oh no. And so it was determined the reason that they failed the stealth roll is because they were way too into their new flight spell and just was going flap, flap, flap. <laughs> That is wonderful. Mm -hmm. Was wondering when you'd show up. I wanted you to have plenty of time to read those files I sent you. you get that thing Some pretty serious shit here. <laughs> hey, you get that thing I sent you? Controls got them. With Jacob no, Kane, I have I never have gotten that thing. I don't words. think you're even sending me anything. I'd say you were off your game. If it didn't make so much damn sense. I've seen so many shady things over the years, and this <sighs> explains every single one of them. We have to bring Kane down, and the court with him. Too many corrupt cops on the force for me to just arrest him. If I had someone I could actually trust on the case, I might be able to get some solid evidence. Then you're stuck with me. I'll go looking for court trouble. This now occurred to me that Jacob Kane and Catherine Kane have the same surname, and there's clearly nepotism going on. I don't know how I missed that. Really wants me to deal with some crooked cops. So I'm gonna make some pigs the yellow triangle down here. What's what are the new yellow triangles for? You're the number one water cooler topic down at the precinct. Keep up the good work. I like that it just says progress further in the investigation without saying what that entails. Very helpful. The last set of yellow triangles. Sorry, I just ran over some cops in Gotham Knights. Bonk. How'd I come up here? I'm Renee in Gotham. As a character, she seems fine. She did just imply that police corruption was entirely the result of this criminality sort of. Which is clearly untrue even within the Batman mythos. Yeah. A little something extra now. All right, there's a bunch of dudes down here. Okay. I need a little extra if um, we're going to keep our arrangement going. On my way over here. Okay. Right above you. Okay. I don't Very think there's a. Above you. I think there's a good way to take down too many Asylum. Maybe this guy over here, but I don't see how to get directly above him. Oh, that'll oh, work. Sorry. Okay, I'm gonna grab him. Grab away. The only one who's far enough away for me to get silently. Oh shit! The game did that thing where you tried to do the silent takedown and it made you use a range attack instead, didn't it? Yeah, it sure did. I'm very sorry. Oh, good. That that Ouch. shit is really frustrating. I'm glad it doesn't only happen to me in any case. Oh shit. Rude. I've got it! I like that I can just increase the fear meters by uh, shooting people nearby. This game says what everyone else is afraid to. The guns can be scary. Oh, I fucked that up. 
Oh yeah, we're uh, sure solving corruption right now. This is all it's gonna take. Well, that guy is dead. He didn't even leave a corpse. I exploded him so hard. I'm done playing. Three out of five, I guess. We did. We finished off three out of five corruption. I, 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 <laughs> deep, I deeply. I deeply dislike this. Me too. Got Oscar for the watch. Mm -hmm. There's the actual little birds. We just have to find more corrupt detectives. Represented by yellow triangles, just like with Clayface's goons. Makes sense. I don't see any other yellow triangles, though. Uh, yeah. Andy says that Renee isn't always written well in media, but I'm hoping it'll encourage people to read the good comics, the ones with her and Kate being messy exes who clearly still have a thing for each other. Mm-hmm. It's a quest objective to continue playing the game. It sure is. I don't know what's going on with that, because that's happened ever since that first um, time, or the second, when we had to redo the thing oh, at the that's, beginning. I saw another yellow one. Oh, where? Uh, add waypoint. I cannot see your waypoints. Oh, um, two thirty-seven. It's uh, right near Gotham City Cathedral to the south. Oh, I can see your waypoints. Oh, okay. What the fuck? Well, good. It was specifically not allowing that before, and I guess my eyes skipped over it this time. Stop three whole corruption with that last one. Oh, yeah, then there will be no more corruption. Then there'll be no more corruption. <laughs> Entire experience with Renee Montoya was a 90s animated series where she's the cop what likes Batman. And Bullock is the cop what hates Batman, but is nevertheless honest. Ah, crud. They see ya. Uh, yeah. Alright, I'm on my way. I thought that I could take out the person I was taking out, like, without a lot of problems. That ended up not being the case. Sweet, you stopped more corruption. Yeah, I know. It was this easy. I'm sure glad we've solved all corruption. Tell Montoya I've got some trash for her to collect. Nice work. And there's certainly reasons why the police would uh, absolutely arrest these people who we just called in for, and well, that we just ambushed and beat the crap out of. That'll that'll totally work. Yeah. All right, Court of Owls is up in Bristol. So, I'm going to okay. I'm going to teleport there. Oh, we can get a cash on the way. I like cash. Me too. Uh I'm also fast traveling. Okay. This is very much of the worst, yes. Why was that mission there? It serves no purpose except to fill time. I mean, that's just sort of this type of game, hey? Yeah. All right, where is the cash? Unlock and collect a bad man's secret cash. Ah, you found it. Shall I do this one while we're on stream? Uh, or do you want to do it? I haven't found it. I'm trying to figure it out. Oh, okay. It's to my right, I guess, over this way. Certainly the marker for it is. Oh, I see it. Excellent. There's a thing. Yes, please go ahead and hit it. Uh, it's, it's near to where I am. Ah, yes, here we go. Jason, please. Red Hood acknowledged. 
all emitter. Okay, the emitters are this way. Well, no time like the present. Yeah, it's just straight forward. Pretty straight ahead, it looks like. No, yeah. oh, no, Jason, Jason, please. <laughs> Identity. There. Just barely got it in time because I didn't overshoot. Jason overshot. Oh, wow. Oh, wait. Oh, there's... no, it was because it vanished after. Okay. Some guys over here. They're wearing Harley masks. And they're gonna beat the crap out of this dude. Okay. We should probably put a stop to that. <laughs> right. I'll take. I'll take. Twenty-two is probably interrogatable. Yeah. I'll take pig mask. You grab the other one. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I'll take out that fire bug. Much appreciated. Cat don't got this stuff. And let me tell you what you want to know. Good enough for me. Hooray. We did it. Solved corruption and violence. And all we had to do was <laughs> more violence. violence. <laughs> but clearly, this is a sustainable solution. <laughs> oh, I found a batarang too. Ooh, sweet. On top of this water tower. Excellent. On my way over now. We want to try and get this page or whatever. I know we found it. Page? Yeah, between us and the yellow thing, there's. Gloria Strigaday. Yeah. yeah. Let's check it out. Yeah. See what kind of uh, history we can learn. Well, you know what they say history is written by the Strigaday. Very much so. Pages of the mythical Historia Strigate are scattered across Gotham. Discover them all to learn them. Text. Um, there's I think an owl symbol right here. Okay. No, oh, there sure is. It was even white for a moment. Now it's not glowing anymore. Huh. I wonder why it was glowing and then wasn't. Or any other... Whoa, what oh, the I fuck? Healed. Oh. I healed. Okay. My I screen healed. just suddenly flashed and I was confused. Yeah, I healed. Okay. I healed with my, with my heal, which heals you also. I'm You're very welcome. glad. I'm very glad you have healed me. It has to be that grave, but I don't know how to activate it. Now, where is that? Punching it doesn't work. I know, right? Oh, no, here's an another one, I guess. Ah. But I can't interact with it in any useful way either. Uh huh. And another one over here. Interesting. I've got three court symbols. All the same. Oh, now here's another, another one. Where is it? Guess we're just following them? I don't understand this puzzle. Yeah, it didn't explain it very well, I don't feel. God damn it, Andy. So if we trace the pattern between the owl symbols on the D-pad, that'll open the gold door. <laughs> this game is not that clever. Oh, shit. Not too many games are as clever as Tunic, though. Tunic was really very good. It scratched those Fez uh, itches that I've had ever since I've completed Fez. Ah. Uh. Do you want to just not do this? Because... Yeah, this is... I'll look up a guide <laughs> if yeah, we want to we'll do it. Because uh, uh, this is just feels very nothing. Oh, hang on. Do we need to oh. 
AR scan them? Oh, that's... Why did I not think of that? No, that's not there. Okay. It indicates... It, when I do the scan part on it, it says it indicates that an excerpt of this Historious Rigadine is nearby. It does say tap AR to briefly highlight symbols in the area, and it sure does. Yeah, and we can do that part. Uh-huh. That's why it was glowing, anyway. But yeah, all I can think of is that it wants us to follow the symbols. Probably see the next one from... Now, where is it? Spot, except not really. Wait, yeah. is this it? Is no, that that's it? a light. That's uh, a that's a light that needs to be changed. Let's just not do this. Yeah, yeah. This, this, I feel myself becoming very frustrated very quickly with this, and I want to not. Sounds like a plan, or a lack thereof. I mean, planning to not do anything is still a plan. That's true. Especially if we're pirates. And, yeah. and cannot have a personal vegetable we relationship. Have a personal vegetable relationship with vegetable guy. Well, uh, we just gotta do throws for these guys. That's simple enough. I'm gonna hit this okay. guy with a mop. Okay. Because I think he's impersonating a janitor and that's not cool. That's stolen valor. Yep. Uh, hang on. Not gonna let. Oh, there we go. Hey. Oh. <laughs> I tapped the button. Hey, Red Hood! Give yourself up! Stand clear! Ah, rude. One throw. Oh, we got all of them. Good. Yeah, I did one and did the other. Okay. Shoot him in the kneecap. Yeah. Totally non lethal rounds. You can survive being shot in the knee. Yeah. You sure can. All right, find and scan evidence of a cover-up. That's gonna be around this area. Ah, okay. There's a baseball bat with barbed wire. You know, classic wrestling prop. Bang, bang. Here's um some empty blood vials, apparently. Here's a- yield again. The freak's bat. It is inconsistent with the crime committed. Oh, that's toxic barrel? Yeah. Toxic. Over here. My brain is suddenly filled in. It's like, hey, if Axe like body spray made proper cologne, they would call it toxic. <laughs> I'm glad that bat command still occasionally gets use. Well, now it just wants us to reach the hideout, so we've gone too far. Yeah. Not seeing anything glowing other than the vials and the bat. Oh, oh wait, here it is. Just a Court of Owls mask. I knew it. They were about to torch it. Tell Montoya she was right. The cops were covering up stuff for the court. Roger. She be really? Because it looks more like they're trying to make it look like the court was doing something? Message from Penguin. Please return as soon as possible. Sounds good. See you soon. Got a message from the Penguin. Alfred did not sound happy about the Penguin. Like, you, why do you... Yeah. Why do you... It'll... Talk to that terrible little man. Oh, our next, um, that we're high enough level, 
our next uh, Mr. Freeze level is actually called Breakout at Blackgate. Mm -hmm. Is that the one that we already tried and quit? Yes, I think so. Okay. It's the Blackgate map, except it's got a bunch of ice over it, and then there was a uh, yeah. fucking that boss fight that didn't. It was like we could we could have done it, but it would have taken like a whole hour. Yeah. That's not ideal. Mm hmm But you know uh, how you make things difficult, number go up. Number continue to go up, it seems. Mm-hmm. That's what video game are. Number go up. What more you need? It not perfect system. <laughs> Uploading clues. All right. I helped you. Now you gotta help me. My family found out about our little shit. They're up for blood. Oh shit, we gotta beat up the other cobble pots. Oh shit. I think Ozzy's dead. They got Penguin pinned down at the Iceberg Lounge. Oh. Yep. Uh, I guess we should go help him. Be the league's priority. Oh, that's a shame. Right. See, I'm gonna look at crafting. Ooh, I don't have enough salvage for this suit. I'm three salvage short for this fucking suit. <laughs> Holy crap. Ah, uh, damn. Also, it just looks like, like, tech, technological Deadpool. Yeah, it sure does. That's probably the metal suit, huh? Yeah. Looks plastic, but yeah, it probably is supposed to be a metal suit. Uh, no, that's the um term for the. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Saying it doesn't look very metal. Yeah. Well, I can make new uh, rounds that are very powerful. Crafting success. I think I'm maxed out on all of my currently available equipment. I have a suit, but I can't I can't make it yet. Uh, I just like you can only fuse mod chips, so I can't like break them down. Hey, do you know who these people are? Which people? Um, so I looked at my challenges, and I have a list of Gotham's Most Wanted. Oh. And... Uh, I, I was wondering if they were, like, known to people who care deeply about Batman, but I think they're not. I think they just did some stuff. that app. Oh, challenges, um, you said, right? Yeah, in challenges. Okay. Gotham's most wanted. True aim. So oh, that's Deadshot. I score. Don't know who that is, but he's wearing the same outfit. Edison. Okay. Yeah, most of these are just, they don't even have names. unique um, models. All right, uh, let's go bust Ozzy out, I guess. Do we have to? In, he's Danny DeVito. Ready to go? Uh, sorry, I am getting rid of my exclamation points. Okay. I'm I... I'm so worn out on trying to get rid of exclamation points because of Final Fantasy Thirteen. Yeah, I know. Defeat League of Shadow Assassins. Defeat Feral Talons and clear an owl's nest. 
our current momentum ability challenges. Have to interrogate Court of Owls informants to find owls' nests. Or patrol to discover ongoing crimes. Either do the specific thing or just do whatever. Just do some shit. Okay. All right. Yeah, ready. I hit the wrong button. I keep tripping out over like touching my face. Yeah. Yeah. Um, just because I'm used to like putting uh, like shadow on most days, but I don't have it on today, so I don't worry about scratching up my eyebrow. Get to break his, we probably get to break his door again. Rule Sweet. of three. Just... Yeah, it just keeps happening, huh? This time we're not going to be fighting his bodyguards, though, I guess. Oh, yeah, they're all not. Damn it. Yep. Look at this. Don't worry, they're just unconscious. Yep. Probably. Nah, dead. It says dead. Oh, it actually says dead? Penguin's guard dead. Nice. See, other people can kill, but when we kill, it's just knocking yeah, this, them unconscious. This one has two whole machetes poking out of their center space. Oh, he sure does. Well, I think we're too late. Can anyone hear me? No, he's still alive. He's just up there. Head to the wall like a butterfly. Yeah. Oh, hey, I got this one. You can't just... No. <laughs> Sound of gas releasing. I know it ain't worth much to say this, but it was either you or me. What a twist. Who could have possibly seen this coming? And frankly, <laughs> it will always be me. <laughs> oh, is this where we, like, uh, go to sleep and then we do, like, a Mad Hatter boss fight? <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't be out of place in Batman. Oh, no, you get yours. Oh, yeah, it's showing me. Is it showing Barb in the cutscene for you? Yeah, yeah. So, why does it only... It seems so random. I think we're in different places. Oh, that could explain it. <laughs> they, they look quite similar, but I think we're... Different cells? Yeah. And these animations are very, very different. Oh, yeah. Oswald. It is, in fact, a scarecrow fight. Oh, How good. is this place anyway? What's that smell? Definitely assuming scarecrow. You there? Batgirl? Yes, I'm on my own for now. <laughs> Jason tried to call Batgirl. She, cut, she tried to call, uh, the... Ah. Uh, so it's actually okay. Well... 
Got us both at the same time, huh? Yeah, did you see me flinch the hardest? Yep. Okay, it was good. like at the exact same moment, too. Jason is just unhappy about being here. <laughs> it's a photo of him getting it. Yep. Oh, that's so good. The hell is wrong with this thing? AR okay, doesn't now. work. All right, I'll crouch under these. Now I'm going to get stabbed from underneath, right? Or above. Very possible. Ah, there was a little dude. Oh, there's another set of spikes. Crouch under. Freaky little guy. Yeah, just some freaky little dude. Okay, now we got spinning saw blades. That's good. You know, if this is a scarecrow fight, this is way lamer than the uh, than the Arkham ones. Oh fuck, got me. Yeah. Rotating knives, yes. Oh, I don't get rotating knives. Oh, oh you didn't get the saw blades? No, I get uh. Oh, you're so talented. Fire. Can I get a copy for my wall? Oh, fun. Ceiling. Uh huh. I do like that it's saving a picture of each death. That's very funny. Oh, it's just putting me right back to the saw blades right away. That's interesting. That makes it less monotonous. How the fuck do I get through this? Not space. Everything's been corrupted by capitalism. Ow, damn it. Oh, motherfucker. I do have to crouch. That much is clear. Also healing me each time visibly. What the hell just happened? Right, where's, there's the third, and fourth dead. pictures, and fifth pictures. Isn't gonna work on me. Just a whole bunch of pictures to imply that we've actually done this more times than we have. So that's kind of interesting. So, not all of the fire torches from the ceiling are active. Uh -huh. and, I, and I needed to figure out which one to burn so that I can go in and uh, I had to scoot under the knives while avoiding the saw blades because they were at different uh, height levels. Batman just have, must just have better fears than the chains. Apparently. Apparently, Jason's fear is rotating saw blades. Oh, screw this. Well, I mean, his fear surely would be the Lazarus pit. Dead end here. Now I go backwards and it's changed, of course. I know how this goes. This is. Oh, here's the rotating knives. Oh, I've got fire up ahead. Oh, yeah, we switched, I guess. I guess so. And I gotta figure out which ones are not active. Oh, I can actually see pretty clearly since you pointed that out to me. That's very simple. Yeah, the remember to crouch through the rooms with the saw blades because the knives are at a uh, chest level. Oh, it's filled in like a whole bunch of you know, pictures from the seven link. Yeah, it did that to me um, after I got hit by the saw blades. So the implication is that we've actually done this far more times than we're playing through. Oh. I found my way to the end, looks like. I'm very happy. I hope it removes me from this cutscene as well. Oh, there's a lot of dead court members. Um, I can go either left or right. Damn it, I got too close. Yeah, that one was a little tricky. I, I deeply dislike it. Hmm. Oh shit, there's a... That's messed up. There's Jason being thrown against a wall. Bikes again. Oh no, now Bruce is disappointed in the voiceover. See, now we're getting actual fears of Jason Todd. 
You know, being revived after death over and over again fits for Jason's fears, but not Barb's. Yeah. I do like I the fact know. that... I, think... I do like the fact that Bruce break, was breaking down when the Scarecrow was scaring him, and Jason's just annoyed by it. It is the bat symbol. I too am a failure to uh, my second father figure, and presumably my regular father figure. Uh huh. I found uh, I found Bruce's grave. Ah. Uh. So that's fun. I have a feeling it doesn't matter which direction I go. In. Oh, good. There's now? Jason wearing an owl mask. Ah. Uh. Me wearing an owl. Owl mask. Oh, good. We're at the exact same point. Dude, nope, don't run directly into those. How many horror games lose the scare factor when you realize they're set up identically to haunted houses? Ooh. Yes. Apparently, I was the worst Robin. Um, so they're doing a little bit. Yeah, because they're showing yep. Jason in the Lazarus pit. That makes a lot of sense. Uh, so I just found my personal one, which is um, not who I am. The not Oracle anymore. computer. Ah. Uh -huh. uh, showing a bunch of glitchy Port of Owls imagery. Ah. Uh -huh. God damn it! That's great. I feel like Batman was supposed to have disappeared by the time I reached the corner here, but they mistimed it. <laughs> I think this would work a lot better if our characters were reacting to the shit going on, like in Arkham Asylum. Mostly they're just like, eh, this is so annoying. Why is this happening? Oh, it's so not Barbara's, really hitting the same. Barbara is a little more tense about it. Ah, uh, Jason's but just I, irritated. <laughs> I held down the open button and the door moved away halfway through holding it down. Oh, that was good. Uh oh. I don't think this was supposed to be comedic. I'm sorry, Gotham Knights. I found Jim's office. Ah, I found a giant sphere that is an owl. Way out. I sure I'm glad we have this orb to contemplate now. I think it wants us both to meet up here because there's one other door. Still can't use AR though. Yeah, so in addition to Bruce's voice, I now have Jim's voice also telling me that I am uh, bad and should not be bad girl. Ah, uh, That's a little more personal than Jason Scott. Piece of shit. I have a feeling you're going to come through this door any minute now, though. Uh, I certainly got a cutscene where I slammed my way through a door. Doesn't show you in here, so I guess I'm supposed to do something with the orb. Yeah, oh, you're there on you the other are. Side of me. Okay. Now you'll come through this door in a second. I oh, I have to open it for you. I think. Oh, cool. Wait. How do I know it's really you? See, this is how the co-op should have been in the first place. This is good. As much as I'm making fun of it. Stop! 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 It's you. And never talk about that again. Ever. It's a setup. It may not be hitting the horror on the head, but it's hitting the co-op vibe on the head. I guess we both stand on one of these owl feet. Oh, that makes sense. Where's the other owl foot? Here we go. I see it. Nothing? Ah. Nothing, tra la la. Yes. Right. Now we're getting somewhere. All right. Um, can you hop up to the other ledge over there? I see it. That did not work. Apparently that didn't work, though. I'm not sure what we're trying to get to work. Okay. Oh, it shows the correct symbol to touch. Oh, okay. Shit, shit. Um... Whoop. 
And if we make a mistake, it apparently summons these these little fellas. Just some, just some fucky little guys. Yeah. Oh, just hold down Y if you need to get rid of their dodge. The uh, AOE from the guns does it. Oh, this will be good. <laughs> okay. All right, so the symbol on the front is going to change when I jump up here. Okay. So match the new symbol. Um, it's showing you what it is. Cause you're in oh, yeah, I guess so. Oh, uh, it's the one say? over on the uh, left side from me. So. Left side from you. So here? Right in front of you, yeah. Okay. All right, what's it showing you? Uh, eagle foot. The way so oh, the, the foot? The other one on the floor. Yeah. Got it. Alright, now it's gonna show the wing the wingalings. The Zelda logo. It freaked out when I Oh. Huh. huh. Alright, let's try again. One. And now owl face over there. No, owl wrong one. Yeah. Face, yes. Owl face. Alright. And then it looks. Do I have to stay here and you have to hit it? Probably. That makes sense. Yeah, it's definitely showing the foot. Yeah, we have to have both pressed. So now it's wing -a -lings. And it freaked out. What the? Oh, we have to do it fast is what's going on. Yeah, we have to do it faster than that. Okay. Here. Okay. Yours. I'll grab this one. And this one. That did it. That was very easy to combo together, so I did both. And the side of the wall comes down to reveal a big door. Yep. I see a red door and I want to paint it black. I saw a really good music video that sets, um... The air is so much clearer here. They must have go left or right? Place. Uh, it's set. Uh, I'll go left. Okay. I'm sure it'll end up at the same place. Yep. Yes. Ah! Flippy floors. Uh, that's at the either surreal versus dark sheep match from Big Gay Brunch. Uh huh. A French version of Paint It Black. That's great. It was. It's, it's quite a rad video. I wish I could find it again. Mm -hmm. But it was on like Vimeo or something. So I've got no fucking clue how to how to dial that up again. Heads up. Yep. Got it. I'm trying. Okay. It was very picky about where it wanted me to. Yeah, it's to a be. little, little loosey goosey, little, little fucky wucky, little bit of, little bit of Monica in my life. Okay, so we've got a sword. Oh, okay. A staff. Um, a mining mattock. And some sort of circle. Yeah, mirror maybe. So a sword oh, it could be a mirror. Or sword, a bowl. staff, mattock, and circle. <laughs> Beat enemies using momentum abilities. Yes, chief. momentum abilities. I think that worked. Oh, good. Because I super didn't get my one. Mm. System Clover has acquired epic increased critical damage, I guess. Oh, good. I don't know I'm why. I'm glad that you did that. I don't know why it says that to you. I didn't even see it on my screen. 
Uh, I didn't catch whether or not it was there. Ah. Uh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was trying to stop it. Let's get him. One, two, three. Just add a diagonal. I've heard of Dutch angles, but this is ridiculous. Pictures of free. You know what happened when Jason overshot his grapple? I assume he broke his leg. Keep going. At least we're together again. At least we're together again. Immediately we split up. Yeah. Oh, hey. Is that a you mace? That is a big fucking mace. Mace, I'm gonna mace you in a minute. Uh, Three Stooges quote from the Three Stooges live action portions of the Three Stooges cartoon. Oh, you probably don't need that, huh? Yeah, this one probably needs um heavy attack. Yeah, Superman punch. Whoa, that didn't work either. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Rally up. Your turn. Hey, yo. I just shot him in the temple. As a warning. And he's right? still alive. Yes, a warning shot. Oh, okay, he can't die because there's a cutscene. Or he can die because a whole statue falls on him. Now, if that fight had been really hard, that would have been an okay payoff. <laughs> but it was Please like just any out. other heavy. Uh-huh. Like, they just talked up how, like, the Ultra Talons were so, were so invincible. It's a do-or-die situation. I'm a little disappointed with them, TBH. All right, there's a desk. When are we going to be out of this uh, hallucination? Dog, chill. All right, let me look what they're seeing. Cut it out. Thank you. I had a CD of Pat Benatar's uh, greatest hits when I was about 16. I got it from the public library and made a copy of it with my personal computer, which I don't recommend doing now, of course, because I'm a public figure on Twitch.television. Uh, but I listened that CD through, like, it was my thing that I went to sleep to for, like, a year. Hey, this owl globe doesn't look healthy. Yeah, it does look a little rusted and sick. <laughs> um, I guess down there next. Oh, there's people there that we can Oop. beat up at these control panels. I found a treasure chest. Sweet. Oh. I've already started a fight, though. Oh, I was supposed to remain undetected, and I didn't notice. Want to restart the fight. Do that? No, we'd have to cancel mission. Ah. Oh, and then we'd have to do everything again. Yeah. Absolutely. Motherfuck that. Yep. I don't see why we have to remain undetected in what is clearly a hallucination. I think it would have just. Like, is this part a hallucination? Because it feels like we're rat manning now and we're behind the whatever bullshit they were doing. 
Then we'd at least have solid floors, though. I guess. It's like that. It's like the one episode of Gargoyles that I remember with the. Um, not Hand of Fate. That was actually a Batman episode. Um, the Illuminati guy does. traps. Uh, Room assembly controls. Oh no, you're right. We are in Portal. Go on. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, gargoyles. Oh, where the Illuminati yeah, guy traps, like, uh... Awesome. One of his lackeys and, uh, Goliath in a... Like, nonsensical puzzle maze like this. That it, like, it... It's supposed to be just a building in New York, it makes no fucking sense that it manages to do this. Uh-huh. Yeah, I that's... Found another treasure chest. That is the feeling I'm having right now. <laughs> fucking hell. I thought the hallucination landed when you met up again. Like, I think I guess done. it did, but this makes no goddamn sense in context. But, like, if they could... If we were just, like, drugged, right, why wouldn't they just kill us while we were drugged right because As they're super villains i guess right but even then why wouldn't they just like actually have murder machines that kill us i don't know this one's kind of wild not gonna lie uh that thing's yellow over there the oh, it sure is. I tried shooting materials. at it. I tried shooting at it, and it wasn't well, working. Well, oh. explode if pressure valves are damaged. Okay, there's some stuff there. Oh, my guns aren't working. Neither are my batarangs. Weird. Oh, okay, you have to shoot the yellow part, not the part you automatically lock onto. Oh. Yeah. So that's fun. Like, even if this is not hallucination, this makes no goddamn sense. This is, this is very silly. Water so damn cold. Hey, oh, okay. Steam valve. Steam valve in both halls. I'm right behind you. Excellent. More catacombs, huh? Uh-huh. You know, I'm surprised you don't get more fucking sinkholes in Gotham with all of this just sort of abandoned tunnel infrastructure. Yeah, it seems like there's tunnels under every street and building. Yeah, and like none of it's shored up. Uh-huh. Look at this. This place is about to fall apart. Here's a treasure chest. Oh, hooray. I have enough salvage to uh, make that new suit now. Nope, I have apparently not found enough of the purple one still. Alright. Like Interrogate the head surgeon. His project. All right, sure. There's only the one guy, huh? Uh, looks like. And I'm gonna try and sneak up on him and just grab him for an interrogation. You do that. Hey, what's up? Talk, and I won't start breaking things. What is this place? <laughs> we trapped the volunteers here for Project Goliath. It's a Talon deployment. Volunteers? The dead can't consent to your experiments. <laughs> oh, you do care about that, huh? Uh huh. For the cause. That's Solomon Grundy. I'm going to knock you out now. I'm going Solomon to knock Grundy? you out. Now. It looks like Solomon Grundy. It's a big white guy. Talon army. But you could tell me that this is just what was the inside of that, like, mace armor. and. Yeah. But we did have kints about uh, Solomon Grundy near the beginning of the game. That is true. Solomon Grundy, born on a Monday. Maybe we'll get Grundy pads, like in that uh, DC Supervillains game Alice played. 
Oh, I wish I had thought to save the one we had. The number? Uh, yeah, the number for the quote. Even this elevator doesn't sound safe. And elevators are extremely safe. Where is this? Uh-huh. Where is it? Uh-huh. Where in the city of Gotham does this structure exist? Grab the... Oh, he's gonna see me. Shit. That's fine. Okay. Turn. Oh, he turned away. Good. I got this one. Grab this guy at the controls here. Need to check that out. Oh, he alerted the other guy, but you still got the takedown. Good hey, job. Okay. Let's clear the court operators, but we did already. Oh, wait, there's one more. Wow, he's very far away and in shadow. I'm taking a leak. He is. He's just pissing on the pipe over here. The sub 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 basement. Ah, of course. Right. These things are in stasis. But if I overload the cooling system, it would stop them. Those controls should do the trick. Nice. I like Override. that the controls are just a big metal wheel. Big, beautiful, understandable metal wheel. Mm hmm. Oops. The fucking burst fire on the guns is ridiculously powerful. The other wheel. Health pack. Another health pack. It's so simple, even a Chris Redfield could use it. Up, <laughs> <laughs> uh, steam vents have opened. Yep. I guess they're cryo vents. Not letting me shoot at the guy I put the bomb on, but I can still see the bomb. Finally. Fence break. Ooh. Right. Slips. Override the failsafe. Certainly in the middle. That also a giant metal wheel? Nah, it was just a button. Perform perfect evades. All right. I'll be trying to do that. Oh. Apparently you can only perfect evade the last of those three hits. That was too quick. There's one. Oh, missed that one. Missed that one too. Ah, technically perfect. I'm just luring him into using easy to dodge attacks. All right, that's four down. And there's the fifth. So now we I can just it. beat him up. Now what's this new one I have? Oh, okay. Just drop bombs on him. Oh, I also got a new one. Wait. Oh, he was Damn healing. It, I knew that's what he was going to do. Yeah, I, I got away from him because I thought he was charging up an attack. Let's 
What's your new one do? Uh, I think it. Okay. Yeah, I'm waiting to see what your uh, new ability does. Oh, it, uh, I can't use it. I need another moment. Oh, okay. Dang, apparently. I didn't oh. know it needed two. Ouch. Oh, okay. I have two now, so I can use it. Um, I think it's just an attack buff. Okay. Come on. You're better than me. I'm good, I'm good. Out, no. Barb. Barb. Got okay. stuck in the cryo. I got stuck in between the cryo and the, and the basement. Some ice in a hard place. Thank you. That was correct to say. No, oh, no. You're not done yet. My hero. Heads up. Oh, no one does that. I wish I had known. I'd have done it closer. Uh, here's mine. And what was the other thing that... Um, RB plus X should do the attack buff thing. And RB plus hold Y is the bombs for me. I think the ones that go on X are generally buffs. That's the impression I'm getting anyway. Oh good, more ninjas. And now they're frozen ninjas. Ninjasicles, if you will. Plan B, and twice as much gunpowder as plan A. Okay, so the sub 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 basement is about to become sub 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 merge. Not to mention sub 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 zero. It's fine, they've been frozen in carbonite. I'll be blind for a few hours. <laughs> I want to tell you how much I love it. Because Sub 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 Zero is very good. Why thank you. I love you for many reasons. The fact that you are very funny is among them. I appreciate that. Well, we just grappled away because that conversation got difficult. We really are like Batman. Mm hmm. I'm glad this game didn't crash again. Oh, we went into the red on this, huh? Uh-huh. I did not realize it was like almost 11.30. Yeah, this 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 has been fun. I'm just passing. Oh good, we've got ninjas attacking random places in the city now, I guess. Oh, well, shit. um I made it out. Red Hood, are you there? Your on the bad computer. Still in an instance. I read you, Belfry. What the fuck? It's good to hear you. Did you voice. see me do that? I, I did. Okay? Oh, I stepped off the ledge and for some reason it flung me into the air. Oh, crap. It says return to the Belfry. Yeah, so maybe this isn't an instance. Maybe this is a new version of the same map. Mm -hmm. Although I think we haven't really... No, we've been around this side of the town. Yeah. Yeah, I think they just... Reskin the map for this. Zero crime stopped, but two bonus objectives completed. Ah, oh, dang, ninjas! We're gonna have to fumigate the whole city. We're gonna have uh, to put a. It's we're fine. We're gonna have to put a bubble over it, like Hugo wanted us to. We're gonna have to like come to him for that. It's fine because this is the rule of ninjas: is that the more there are, more ninjas there are, the weaker they are. So two ninjas is half as powerful as one ninja, and so on. The talons, the that is true. All punishment for exposing the court. You know, as long as we don't kill any ninjas, they won't even be able to open a fucking door. The labyrinth wasn't just meant to kill us. The court wanted to get in our heads. It might have worked. We'll be okay, Tim. Oh, so my mother brought us a mountain. Of betting, Batman didn't kill people like but pillows and blankets. I'm currently just monsters. leaning on it. Oh, I was wondering what I all that stuff dead. was. Uh huh. You think I'm a monster? We have one setback. 
And this is where you go, Tim? Murder? I get No, I'm with Tim. People, but the labyrinth was more than a setback, Babs. Don't talk about me like I'm not here. You're not Bruce. None of you are. I am very much Enough. still with Tim. Maybe Alfred, too. But mostly Tim right now. Mm-hmm. You notice that Alfred looks slightly more cartoony than the other characters? Every time Bruce came home. Maybe it's because they don't know how to render old people's skin very well. I patched him up. Just as I now do for you. He was often angry. But he never stooped to their level. Except when he did. And neither will you. Batman never stoops to their level is the same as Batman works alone. Batman they keep control. saying it, but it's no. not fucking true. No I work alone, gets, except when I work with Ronaldo, which is I all can't the time. Betrayed. <laughs> the court is made up of Gotham's founding families. They'll protect their own like only family. Oh yeah, that's a really good uh, a really good collar on her uh, on her jacket. But they are mm -hmm. family, not like we are. They may be related, it but they're not family. It Both does make me answer. afraid that she like took the some side work for Abstergo, but like hotel <laughs> is pretty much bulletproof. Then our best course of action isn't war; it's prosecution. I don't think Kane's gonna honor a warrant. He will if we help the cops serve it. Same this is the worst young possible young plan y'all are coming up I with. Think of at least one still on our side. Are they gonna go get Superman? I know he's talking about Renee, but he said it after the mention of Kate's. So I was hoping that he'd get Superman from inside Gotham's walls. Stuff on the board. Yeah, next mission is to go see Montoya. I was certain the labyrinth. Oh, oh got another memory over here for momentum abilities. I'm assuming. Ooh, boxes and props. Fine, Gaston. <laughs> that is some wild shit. <laughs> hey, Jason just said the thing I say. Damn, Alfred. <laughs> After my last tour, I chose to come to Gotham. That path led me to a life I'd never imagined. Tech-powered street gangs, secret societies, heroes in capes. Sounds ah, get it? Because they live in a comic book. Mm -hmm. I thought I was done with war. All I did was trade one for another. I think I have two. The combatants over change. Here. The battlefronts shift. But the costs still add up. That is a really good crying face that Jason's doing. We both have the scars to show. Again, the the face capture and the uh, the performances just blow me away. They're they're really good. Bruce blamed himself. For I your wish death. this game like really took a firm stance on police corruption. But even in the worst. Uh huh. Of we solved all the corruption, though, by beating up five no, you're dudes. Correct. We beat up five <laughs> dudes, and now corruption is done. Fucking hell. Some days I barely feel human. Let alone a better See, Bad Road, that's the problem. No one even knows what it's like to be the Batman. And was proud of how far you'd come. Especially after everything you've been through. That's a good moment. It is. I like that a lot. So I guess that'll be it for tonight. Let me check my gear one more time. Do uh, I have that three purple salvage yet? 
there are definitely other memories hanging around. Do you want to grab them before we go, or do you want to leave that as an exercise for next week? We'll do that next week. Okay. Okay. Suit. Uh, no. I have a team-up toxic suit and a modular toxic suit, and they both require three more purple. That's very annoying. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no stronger pistols, no stronger ammo. Okay, so we have to fight freaks to get purple. Now that I know I can highlight the stuff over here. Oh yeah, can do that some other time. All right. I mean, we fought some freaks. We didn't get any salvage for that. Admittedly, it was only four of them, and that's like apparently the rarest one. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, everyone, for coming. Let's take a look at the schedule for the next week going forward. I was thinking of some. Oops. Turn that. Turn that camera around. All right. So tomorrow, I believe we're sitting at just wild card or nothing. Uh, it's, it's the it's the 24th, so, you know. Uh, yeah. We don't usually stream on the weekends as it is. Yeah. Sunday, we got Wandering Beekeeper playing Wildfires, though it is 25th, so I don't know how firm that is. Uh, Monday, we got... September, getting to start volume. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, depends on if the internet keeps on working. Tuesday, we got Annie playing Immortal Unchained. Wednesday, Tsu's going to play Steel Rising. And Bad Road is going to play, I believe, the last episode of Shadowrun Dragonfall. And I don't know when Andy is streaming now. Um, Thursday will be Alice with Final Fantasy XII and Andy with Tangle Tower. And... Tangle Tower has been great, by the way. Oh, yeah. I That's haven't a... seen a lot of it. Be back Monday. Okay. It's so, a very charming little game. Um, I haven't seen a lot of it, but what I saw was very cute. And then Friday is back around to us with th these, these here... Knights of Gotham, the the Bat Babies. All right, Gaston Peace. I know your peats are cold. Your peats are cold. I know, as it's cold out. All right, and yeah. Um, here's our YouTube channel. Thousands of hours of video there. You know, we've played a lot of games over the years. Oh, I yeah, highly um, recommend. What's up? Oh, uh, they're not streaming at Xenon Fiber. Uh, yeah, that's why I said. Uh, oh, right. Sorry. Yeah, that's why I said. Uh, no one's no one's streaming. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, we got. You can get to it at either YouTube.truck.community or YouTube.com/slash at Squirrelly Gas. You gotta stop licking. You gotta make yourself bleed again. He's got anxiety. Uh, you have a recommendation? Uh, I guess you could watch Annie playing Arkham Asylum. You know, oh, that yeah, was that's good. good. That if was you enjoyed, good. if you enjoy uh, the games about the Batman, Annie had a great time playing Arkham Asylum. That was a blast to watch. And then she tried playing Arkham City, and it does not hold up as well. It's not quite as good. Everything has to be a big open world, which we're now in that phase again. Yeah. We're doing map fucking. Uh-huh. So, yeah, I I guess that's all for now. Thank you for joining me, sweetheart. Happy to. And thank you all for watching. And we'll see you another day. Good night. Good night.